हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वी आर डूइंग चैप्टर नंबर थ्री शेयर्स एंड डिविडेंड एक्सरसाइज थ्री टिल क्वेश्चन नंबर फिफ्टीन ऑलरेडी वी हैव डिस्कस्ड इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो एंड टुडे वी आर स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्सटीन अ कंपनी विद टेन थाउजेंड शेयर्स ऑफ नॉमिनल वैल्यू हंड्रेड रुपीज डिक्लेयर एन एनुअल डिविडेंड ऑफ एट परसेंट टू द शेयर होल्डर्स कैलकुलेट द टोटल अमाउंट ऑफ डिविडेंड पेड बाय द कंपनी Ramesh bought 90 shares of the company at rupees 150 per share. Calculate the dividend he received and the percentage return on his investment. So first of all, we will see what all things are given in the question. First, it is given 10,000 shares. So number of shares are here 10,000. Second, nominal value. Of hundred rupees declared. It means face value, nominal value or face value. It is same. It is given hundred rupees, and annual dividend of eight percent. Dividend percentage is given eight percent. So in the first part, we have to find out the total amount of dividend paid by the company. So we know dividend is equal to number of shares multiply by Dividend percent is multiplied by face value. We have ten thousand shares. Dividend percent is eight by hundred, and face value is hundred. So finally, we are getting here total eight eighty thousand rupees as dividend. Second part, we have to find out the. Dividend received and the percentage return on his investment. So first we'll find out whatever his investment. Investment is he purchased ninety shares and market value is one fifty rupees. So number of shares into market value. Number of shares is here ninety and market value is one fifty rupees. So total investment is thirteen. Thousand five hundred rupees. Second, we have to find out here dividend received. So dividend is equal to number of shares multiplied by dividend percentage into face value. So for Ramesh, number of shares are ninety. Dividend percentage is same eight by hundred into hundred. So total we have seven twenty rupees as dividend here. Third part we have to find out here return percentage. So return percentage is equal to the in income or the dividend received by him by total investment into hundred percent. Dividend is seven twenty rupees. Investment is thirteen thousand five hundred rupees into hundred percent. So zeros we can cancel out. Cancel with nine table, nine eighty and nine fifteen times. Then three can cancel with five table, five three and five sixteen. Sixteen by three percent. Or we can write it five whole number one by three percent. Next we have question number seventeen. A company with five hundred shares of nominal value of one twenty rupees declare an annual dividend of fifteen percent. Calculate the total amount of dividend paid by the company and the annual income of Mr. Sharma. Who hold eighty shares of the company? If the return percent is of Mr. Sharma, from his shares is ten percent. Find the maturity value of each share. So first, they have given number of shares are five hundred. Second, nominal value means face value is given one twenty rupees. Third, dividend percentage is given fifteen percent. In the first part, we have to calculate the total amount of dividend. So, dividend is equal to number of shares multiplied by dividend percentage multiplied by face value. We have total five hundred shares. 
डिविडेंड परसेंटेज इज फिफ्टीन परसेंट फेस वैल्यू इज वन ट्वेंटी रुपीज सो टू जीरोज यू कैन कैंसल आउट एंड मल्टीप्लाई द रिमेनिंग नंबर्स आफ्टर मल्टीप्लीकेशन वी आर गेटिंग हेयर नाइन थाउजेंड रुपीज एज डिविडेंड सेकेंड पार्ट वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट हेयर द मेचोरिटी वैल्यू ऑफ ईच शेयर सो टू फाइंड आउट द मेचोरिटी वैल्यू वी नीड इन्वेस्टमेंट एंड नंबर ऑफ शेयर्स सो फर्स्ट वील फाइंड आउट द नंबर ऑफ शेयर्स हेयर नेक्स्ट वी हैव क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवेंटीन अ कंपनी विद फाइव हंड्रेड शेयर्स ऑफ नॉमिनल वैल्यू ऑफ वन ट्वेंटी रुपीज डिक्लेयर एन एनुअल डिविडेंड ऑफ फिफ्टीन परसेंट कैलकुलेट द टोटल अमाउंट ऑफ डिविडेंड पेड बाय द कंपनी एंड द एनुअल इनकम ऑफ मिस्टर शर्मा हु होल्ड एटी शेयर्स ऑफ द कंपनी इफ द रिटर्न परसेंटेज ऑफ मिस्टर शर्मा फ्रॉम हिज शेयर्स इज टेन परसेंट फाइंड द मेचोरिटी वैल्यू ऑफ ईच शेयर सो फर्स्ट दे हैव गिवन नंबर ऑफ शेयर्स आर फाइव हंड्रेड सेकेंड नॉमिनल वैल्यू मीन्स फेस वैल्यू इज गिवन वन ट्वेंटी रुपीज थर्ड डिविडेंड परसेंटेज इज गिवन फिफ्टीन परसेंट इन द फर्स्ट पार्ट वी हैव टू कैलकुलेट द टोटल अमाउंट ऑफ डिविडेंड सो डिविडेंड इज इक्वल टू नंबर ऑफ शेयर्स मल्टीप्लाई बाय डिविडेंड परसेंटेज मल्टीप्लाई बाय फेस वैल्यू वी हैव टोटल फाइव हंड्रेड शेयर्स डिविडेंड परसेंटेज इज फिफ्टीन परसेंट फेस वैल्यू इज वन ट्वेंटी रुपीज सो टू जीरोज यू कैन कैंसल आउट एंड मल्टीप्लाई द रिमेनिंग नंबर्स आफ्टर मल्टीप्लीकेशन वी आर गेटिंग हेयर नाइन थाउजेंड रुपीज एज डिविडेंड For the second part, we have to calculate annual income of Mr. Sharma, who hold 80 shares. So, annual income means dividend. We have to calculate dividend for 80 shares will be same formula. We have to use here number of shares into dividend percentage into face value. Mr. Sharma is having 80 shares. Dividend percentage is same, 15 percent. Face value is also same. So, calculate. After calculation, we are getting one thousand four forty rupees as dividend he received. Next, they have given if the return percentage is ten percent, then we have to find out the maturity value. So, for we will use here return percentage formula. Return percentage is equal to dividend by his income. Or investment, his investment into hundred percent. So return is given ten percent. Dividend is here one four four zero. Investment we have to calculate and into hundred percent. So we can shift investment another side, and we will get investment is equal to. Ten will come here in division and investment. You can move that side upon ten into hundred. So zero to zero, you can cancel out. We are getting fourteen thousand four hundred rupees is investment, and we know investment is equal to number of shares into market value, which is equal to fourteen thousand four hundred rupees. Number of shares are given here eighty. and market value we have to calculate so we can shift 80 another side 14400 by 80 cancel out and after cancelling we are getting here 180 rupees is the market value for these shares next we have question number 18 by investing 7500 rupees in a company Paying ten percent dividend, an income of five hundred rupees is received. What price is paid for each hundred rupees share? So here investment is given by investing seven thousand five hundred rupees. Means this is investment. Investment is seven thousand five hundred rupees. Company paying ten percent dividend. Dividend percentage is ten percent. Income is five hundred rupees means dividend in rupees is five hundred rupees. 
वट प्राइस इज पेड फॉर ईच हंड्रेड रुपीज शेयर ईच हंड्रेड रुपीज शेयर मीन्स दिस इज अ फेस वैल्यू ऑफ शेयर हंड्रेड रुपीज सो डिविडेंट परसेंटेज इज गिवन डिविडेंट इज गिवन सो वी विल स्टार्ट विद दिस ओनली डिविडेंट इज इक्वल टू नंबर ऑफ शेयर्स मल्टीप्लाई बाय डिविडेंट परसेंटेज मल्टीप्लाई बाय फेस वैल्यू डिविडेंट इज गिवन फाइव हंड्रेड रुपीज नंबर ऑफ शेयर सपोज इट इज एन एंड डिविडेंट परसेंटेज इज टेन परसेंट एंड फेस वैल्यू इज हंड्रेड सो शिफ्ट टेन अनदर साइड एंड वी विल गेट एन इज इक्वल टू फाइव हंड्रेड बाई टेन फिफ्टी शेयर्स सो हियर नंबर ऑफ शेयर्स वी हैव फिफ्टी नेक्स्ट वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द मार्केट वैल्यू वी नो मार्केट वैल्यू इज इक्वल टू इन्वेस्टमेंट अपॉन नंबर ऑफ शेयर्स इन्वेस्टमेंट इज सेवन थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड रुपीज नंबर ऑफ शेयर्स आर फिफ्टी आफ्टर कैंसलिंग वी आर गेटिंग वन फिफ्टी रुपीज एज मार्केट वैल्यू नेक्स्ट वी हैव क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइनटीन अ मैन बाइज फोर हंड्रेड टेन रुपीज शेयर एट अ प्रीमियम ऑफ टू रुपीज फिफ्टी पैसे ऑन ईच शेयर इफ द रेट ऑफ डिविडेंड इज एट परसेंट फाइंड हिज इन्वेस्टमेंट डिविडेंड रिसीव एंड जेल्ड सो फर्स्ट दे हैव गिवन अ मैन बाई फोर हंड्रेड इट मीन्स नंबर ऑफ शेयर आर हेयर फोर हंड्रेड टेन रुपी शेयर इट मीन्स इट इज इट्स फेस वैल्यू इज टेन रुपी शेयर एंड मार्केट वैल्यू एट अ प्रीमियम ऑफ टू रुपीज फिफ्टी पैसे मार्केट वैल्यू विल बी टेन प्लस टू फिफ्टी मीन्स ट्वेल्व रुपीज फिफ्टी पैसे रेट ऑफ डिविडेंट इज गिवन एट परसेंट नाउ फर्स्ट पार्ट वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द इन्वेस्टमेंट इन्वेस्टमेंट इज इक्वल टू नंबर ऑफ शेयर इन टू मार्केट वैल्यू we have 400 shares market value is 12 rupees 50 paise after multiplication we will get 5000 rupees as investment second part we have to find out the dividend dividend is equal to number of shares multiply by dividend percentage multiply by face value 400 shares are there dividend percentage is given 8% face value is given 10 rupees cancel out and after multiplication 320 rupees we are getting here dividend third we have to find out the yield or the return percentage third part we have to find out yield dividend upon investment into 100% 320 rupees we are getting as dividend and investment was 5000 rupees multiply by 100% two zeros you can cancel here one zero here and after dividing we will get 6.4% return next question number 20 A man invested ten thousand four hundred rupees in six percent share at one hundred and four rupees, and eleven thousand four hundred forty rupees in ten point four percent share at one forty three rupees. How much income would he get in all? So here, man is doing two investment. In the first investment, he is doing ten thousand four hundred rupees. Dividend percentage is given six percent, and market price at one hundred and four means it is market price is given. For the second investment, investment is eleven thousand four forty rupees. Dividend percentage is given ten point four, and at one forty three means this is market value. Here face value is not given, so we will take hundred rupees face value. If it is not mentioned in the question, we have to take hundred rupees. Next, we have to find out the total income what he will get from both the investment. So first we will calculate the number of shares in the first investment and the second investment. In first investment, number of shares we have to calculate. Number of shares is equal to investment upon market value. Investment is ten thousand four hundred rupees upon one 
hundred and four. So here we are getting hundred shares. In the second part also same way we will find out the number of shares. Investment upon market value. Investment is here eleven thousand four forty rupees divided by one forty three rupees. After cancellation we are getting here. 80 shares now in both the cases we will calculate the income income means dividend so dividend in the first case is number of shares into dividend percentage into face value number of shares are here 100 dividend percentage is 6 percent into 100 so here we are getting income as 600 rupees in the second case same way we will calculate number of shares are 80 dividend percentage is 10.4 percent and market value face value is 100 rupees so here after multiplication we are getting 832 rupees so total income will be the sum of these two income therefore total income will be 600 plus 832 equal to 1432 rupees. So in this video we are doing till here remaining questions we will continue in the next video. Thank you for watching this video.